How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you today. We're gonna continue our climb to Diamond today with Artemis. Like I said in the last video, we are gonna be going all the way to Diamond with Artemis this season because that was a legend that you guys chose when I asked. However, I will be playing other legends in ranked after we get Diamond. Artemis. I'm just gonna go ahead and hop right in. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. Uh, we're gonna be playing uh, probably four or five games of rank depending how far or I mean how long they last and uh, Yeah, hopefully I will end with more elo than what I started. That's always the goal and um, You know even if I don't achieve the goal, it's okay. It's okay Going against derpy dude playing as mad scientist gold forge scarlet Uh, I could tell already is better at Lance than me. And I really want to get that scythe. I think I got her there. Yeah, all right. I am not... Feeling comfortable with the Lance versus Lance. She seemed like she was better. I'm not really a Lance main, you know what I mean? Hey, there's a lot of missing going on, but as long as she's doing missing too, that's the most important thing. Hold that. Fight for me. Oh gosh, I'm. Ah. Hold that, hold that. Nope. Oh, I was way too slow to react, and there's a hammer in my face. <laughs> oh, that slot. That's. Oh, I could have done better there. Alright. That's alright. We learn from our mistakes. There we go. She did. She did. Oh, she stopped dead. Oh my gosh. Hold that. Thank you. I took the hammer in the face. You could take the, the lance in the face. That's only fair, right, Scarlet? Oh my goodness, I was not expecting that. Did I make it? No, I didn't. That side sig came out of nowhere, dude. That was either a 1000 IQ play or just mad luck. Either way, that was pretty crazy. Nope. GG, dude. GG! Oof. Axe or nothing yet playing a Lance and Hammer Legend. Interesting. All right, well, that was a GG. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, let's go to Eclipse Artemis. And I kind of want to use Charged OG for this one. I I love the scythe. You guys know I, Penumbral Crescent, pretty much my favorite scythe. But, oh, you know what? Somebody said that I need to use Slapshot Artemis. So I would do that for you, bro. Um, I don't remember who said that, but somebody wanted me to play Slapshot Artemis. Typically, I don't use this skin because, I don't know, I just think that the there's other Artemis skins that look better, but eh, it's still a cool skin. So I'll use it. And going against uh, Taros. Taros is uh, tricky. They're either uh, really, really good or they're not that great. So we'll see. I tend to not do that well versus Taros, so I'm a little nervous.
There we go. Got some good reads. And he should be dead. There he is. Just die, Taros, please. Bad enough that I have to fight you. I'm so nervous when I fight a Taros, you know? He is being a lot more patient now, which is probably smart for him. Oh, what? That axe recovery, dude. That's okay. He's doing some good dodging. He did a great punish there. Got him. Oof. All right. Yeah, I'm definitely sticking to Scythe. When I use Lance, he almost caught me back up. See what I mean, Taros? He's either a beast, he'll kill you in one hit, and I gotta hit him like 2,000 times to kill him. GG, dude, GG! Never mind, he ain't dead. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you dead now, big boy. No, you're not. Mad respect, mad respect. Holy cow, that was close. Oh my gosh, if he would have released a split second earlier, I would have been dead, GG. Holy moly, that was crazy close. And look at that, our elo is exactly the same, or it was. Whoo, that was way close, dude, way too close. All right, uh, there you go, Slapshot Artemis. Now, I used Dark Heart in the last one. I think I pretty much used them all, except I don't think I used Seraph Artemis yet in this run. Let's do Gold Forge Seraph Artemis. Oh, this looks so clean. Um, gonna keep going with the Grim. Got to keep that Spooktober theme going. You, you guys see I got the whole spooky theme going here. That's right. That's right. I believe that BMG will be coming out with uh, more Halloween themed uh, stuff probably in the coming weeks. And when that happens, I'll definitely do a video about it. So look forward to that as much as I am because usually BMG kills it with the Halloween stuff. Uh, last year, that new Azuri skin was so cool. All right, going against the same dude, but this time he f he's picking Hattori. He wants to fight speed with speed. I like that. I like fast-paced battles. I'm really bad with Scythe or Lance, so I'm like really nervous here. No, ho, ho, this is a. Uh... 
Good dodge. Having a hard time hitting this dude. But luckily he's Hattori and Hattori is weak. <laughs> he held onto the wall just a fraction of a second too long. Oh man, this guy is such a close match. Oh, that's a kill. Nope, maybe not. What? Actually, I probably could have got back there. I thought I was dead. I, th I didn't think I had any uh, recoveries, but I must have touched the wall there. Shouldn't assume I was dead, but oh well. Got him, dude. Got him with the gimp. Got a whole stock advantage. All right, I need to take advantage of the advantage and get the win. Oh, I didn't touch! I didn't do a good job of getting a lot of damage there, but he is in yellow and Hattori is kind of weak, so... He's sticking to the ground attacks, which is probably smart. That's, that's game. Oh my gosh, what a good game. I had a whole stock advantage and I lost. Uh, did I go exactly back to 1803 so we're even again? Oh no, 1802. Oh my goodness. I I pretty much threw that match, guys. He he was so good on the sword. Ah, ah, ah. You You always... Whenever matches like that happen, guys, don't you always feel like you wish you could just do do it again, do over? Uh, but of course, there are no do-overs. Um, you can only learn from your mistakes. So in that situation, I think I should have been more careful, more calculated. He was definitely more patient. And uh, maybe I should have been more aggressive. Artemis. What do you guys think? I'm always open to feedback. Like if you actually uh, think you could, uh, you know, give me some feedback room for improvement let me know in the comments what I could have done differently there I think uh, I think he just outplayed me there though simple as that outplayed me he wanted it more definitely I kind of got a little bit more relaxed started playing a little bit less aggressively I don't know if I get that dude again I'm definitely going to keep the aggressive uh, aggressive plays on because that seemed to work a lot better don't think I'm gonna match him again though because I probably would have got him by now. I really need to work on my on my lance. I think the scythe is not the problem, even though I lost that match using the scythe. I don't think the scythe is a problem. Wow, another Taros, man. What are Taros making a comeback in popularity? Nobody used to ever play him, and now I'm running into Taros all the time. Palladium! This guy I think I've seen a long time ago, man. He's he's an OG legend. Alright. No, uh, no good luck. No letting uh, me get the weapon or anything like that, I see. Alright, fair enough. I mean, you can play the game how you want to play. And I will do the same.
Wow, that was close. Again, the axe recoveries are so insanely good. I'm getting lucky that I'm actually dodging them. Wow, man, one hit, one hit from Taro, so I'm dead. But I'm in red. Yep, yep, there it is, boys, there it is. He, he was in his comfort zone right there. I shouldn't have held the uh, recovery as long as I did, maybe. It definitely becomes more, more readable. We're not gonna get bullied by the Taros, guys. We're not. No amount of muscle is going to make us nervous. We got this. What? I was doing recovery before he did ground pound. Oh my gosh, that was crazy, dude. GG, but I want to watch that replay. What? Oh, I should have chased maybe, I don't know. All right, let's watch this. He hits me there. Alright, maybe not, man. Look at that. So close. So close. I thought I had him. Oh my... What? What? I'm... Alright. I'm not even... I'm not even under this. Alright, well, GG, dude. That was crazy. Let's see where we're at. I don't know if we ended higher than where we began, but it's okay. Not a big deal. We still did good. I mean, I got two wins, two losses. That's not bad. That's not bad. We're basically 50%, you know? That's not <laughs> better than, uh, you know, 40% or less. So we're fine. Uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video anyways. Artemis, like I said, it, I knew it would be kind of a challenge to get to Diamond with Artemis, but I know I can do it, guys. You gotta stick with me. Send me your energy, please. Don't leave me out on the road to die. I wanna, I wanna get this, and I know I can. Oh man. If it, if I do feel like I'm hitting a wall with Artemis to Diamond, uh, I'll probably just practice Artemis a lot off camera because I really have not done that. I just, I pretty much am just winging it. But you know, it's all good. We will get it. I feel it. That Taros was really, really good. I think the I think Palladium was better than the first Taros I fought for sure, and I almost beat Palladium. That was really close. Ugh. And then that one match uh, I, before the Taros, ah oh, man, that Hatori. I should have had that game too. So it's all right. We're 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 losing by very small margins, and that's at least we're not getting blown out of the water or anything. And and when we do win, we're winning well. You know, in rank 1v1, it's pretty much don't make mistakes. And every time your opponent makes a mistake, you want to punish it as hard as you can. No mercy. That's basically the mindset you have to have if you want to get to diamond or even platinum. Don't make mistakes and punish your opponents. That's my last little tip in this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Please show your support by dropping a like. Leave me a comment, whatever you want to say, good or bad. You know, <laughs> let me know. Anyways, this is Lucian Sword. Hope to see you in the next one, guys. Take it easy.